And here we are, boys and girls. Welcome to the second leg of the semi-final of the Copa Libertadores. As you can see on the league, we are just cruising. It's been amazing. And uh, look, I want you to maybe look at some uh, statistics. Uh, where is it? Here, look. I have... I think this is my central defense, yeah. Look, three goals here. Ah, uh, where is it? Three goals here from my central defenders. This is all about the set pieces. I can't believe I've been ignoring set pieces for so long. And just those small adjustments that I explained in the previous episode uh, yield so much results. It's just amazing. And Tete was just unstoppable, okay two goals from penalty spot but he was amazing <laughs> and uh, yeah so we're cruising in the league look at this look at this so many points almost 20 points well if I win the game I have at hand I will be 20 points ahead <laughs> of Gremio <laughs> yeah so the league there's no competition here Palmeiras yeah there's a lot of competition there so I already put the team ah, I always forget <laughs> <laughs> Let's forget. Oh no, okay. This makes sense. The guy's injured, so he cannot play. <laughs> yeah, so Montiel, Becam, Montero, Antonio, Moreno, Enrique, Julian Lopez, Fabian, Minirini, Dentinho. This is going to be our 11 that will hopefully take us to the final. And out going to be these guys. Um, I normally like to have one central defender one left back or right back and then a defensive midfielder an offensive midfielder and two attacking options because I don't have any other more attacking options I did uh, like to have a striker but Kakayol is my striker I've been training him because log 6 in finishing composure is not amazing but yeah and technically is um his best position is shadow striker so yeah so he's my my striker and yeah we are because i've been rotating the team a lot we are 100 percent. and look how many want let's see okay this is easy to mm, chelsea in the mix okay i might sell this one though because um he's not bad but it's not amazing if i get like a lot of money for this guy because occupying a foreign slot i, I might sell him and who's after him Tottenham Real Madrid, yeah, this guy is amazing, this guy has been playing so well, so, so well, and Tete as well, so on the right hand side of our attack, it's, it's okay, who else is wanted, Luis Fabian, who is after him, Inter, okay, Mineirinho, yep, and Dentinho, who's after him, 11 clubs, <laughs> okay, okay, a few big ones, a few almost big ones, Okay, I should, I should be able to keep keep these guys. Let's go. Let's go to the final. I hope you didn't mind the music and the sounds that I put on the previous game, but it just... The purpose was to transmit my emotions. In this game, I'm more calm. We will see. I might, I might put some sound if this game becomes a bit more um, stressful, but, but I, have, I have such a good advantage on the first hand, so it depends how this goes. But yeah, when I'm um, <coughs> in these decisive games, when I'm anxious and a bit nervous, I'll put some of those um, sounds. I think it transmits a bit better what I'm feeling. <laughs> um, yeah, but right now I'm calm. That's why I'm not putting music. Depends how the game goes. Come on. Oh no, counter-attack. Nice. What a tackle there was. Don't make mistakes here. Perfect. There goes Moreno. There he goes. He's so brave, my arm. Oh, Minirinho. Two minutes, two chances to score, and Minirinho missed both. This is. Uh, I hope this is not a sign of what's to come. Minirinho oh, again. Yeah! <laughs> three minutes, three chances, one goal. This is amazing. And again, um, on the corner. This was after a corner. Okay, there's still a lot to play because, you know, you're making passes and crosses and winning second balls and stuff like that. But still, uh, 
I don't know if this is a coincidence, but my corners nowadays are yielding so much danger, so many goals, amazing. Yeah, this is going to be easy. I'm sorry, I might... I fall into this trap a lot. But I have to say what I see. Wow, what a goal from Fabian! <laughs> 10 minutes! We already had 4 chances uh, to score and 2 of those 4 are goals. What an amazing start! And this is all due to rotation. And this time, this season, I didn't make it um, easy for the squad rotation. I really tried to make sure I had two great players for each position. Which fortunately I could finally after five seasons. Nice. Oh yeah. A look at this domination. Six minutes. Wow. This is unbelievable. Moreno. Moreno. Cross. Cross. Go. Three. Three. É do Flamengo! Wow, look at this! 11 minutes 3 nil. Oh god! Are we going to humiliate them? <laughs> are we going to crush them? Let's crush them! <laughs> oh my god! I think I, I, I'm just going to put samba music until the end. Yes, party! Let the party start! This is amazing! Look at the confidence that these guys have. <laughs> they just dribble. Oh, it cross nice. Ding, ding. Oh. It's only 20 minutes, guys. The amount of highlights and goal scoring chances we've had, it's unbelievable. This is amazing. Anthony, no, go to the wing. Oh, or score. <laughs> I wouldn't criticize you too much if you scored instead of going to where you should go. Free kick. <sighs> Not too bad. Half time, nothing else happened. Those first 20 ish minutes was just a massacre, and then nothing else <laughs> happened. I'm not going to change. I, the team is well rested. Um, in normal conditions, I would make the team more defensive, play more slowly, etc. etc. But we are playing so well, the team is well rested. Uh, yeah, I don't see Palmeiras turning this around. Look, they didn't shoot once. Look at this statistic. <laughs> Complete massacre. Oh, this feels so good. After two consecutive years of being frustrated by them, to have this such a, a dominant victory is just amazing. Uh, we still have 45 minutes, so we'll see, but whew, what a great start. Well, you guys doing uh nice okay their first shot on goal and it was on target and almost goal let me pause this a little bit let me just go real quick the team check the team oh they have to play with corona uh, as a, a right back okay that might explain why i could enter so easily <laughs> in their defense <laughs> they're playing with a winger with very poor defensive stats as a right back, uh, but now they are playing with Danilo here, so okay. I don't know why they didn't play with Danilo the first leg, I guess they um, they couldn't have him for some reason. Yeah, the rest of the attack is kind of similar players, but in terms of quality it's not exactly the same players. Yeah, that's why, although his stats are, uh, his uh, rating is not too different, from all the, the rest of the members of the team, but I'm pretty sure Luis Fabian, yeah, our left winger against their right back, yeah, pretty sure, yeah, this is making a big difference. Oh well, tough luck. Okay, Julian Lopez saw yellow card, you know what this means, substitution. Uh, highlight after, I don't know how much time, game is pretty quiet now in the second half which I really don't mind. So good to have a relaxing game against Palmeiras. Although I'd like to humiliate them, but uh, I'm in the Nino. Ooh, with the post, Riba. Oh, it could have been easily four or five. Okay, let's refresh the team a bit. Let's put Tete. Let's see if he's going to um, 
create chaos in their defense and I, I think I'm going to take the other guy with the yellow card playing with 10 men is never a good thing and Cuellar got injured hopefully he can stay until the end because I really don't want to play with 10 men okay, we are playing very calmly I think Palmeiras gave up looks like they only shot once <laughs> the whole game <laughs> Uh, this is total domination, and I have a very offensive tactic. So for them to not even oh great cross, oh, Dentinho really it should be it should be at least five. I think I don't think I'm exaggerating when I'm saying this should be five nil. We, this has been a massacre from start to finish. Come on, one more to make this right. One more, Dentinho. <laughs> Oh, now the universe starts to feel, um, how can I say, normal, aligned, at peace. Because what uh, Palmeiras made us go through is not, it's not right. It is not right. And now the universe is finally in balance. Are we going to score another one? Is it going to be number five? No, it's probably going to be game over. Is it? Uh, the referee, it's already past the extra time, the added time, I should say. Is there a fifth coming, guys? Tete! Tete! He loves to go inside from the outside. Look at these statistics, guys. Look at this. What a freaking massacre. Ah, this feels so good. Let me just look at this. Just a little while longer. Okay, enough. <laughs> what a a delicious victory. Goyas. Goyas in the final. Come on, I have to win this. When is the final? Oh, still long time until we reach the final. Okay, you know what this means, guys? I will... Oh, I'll play against Palmeiras soon. So I don't know which of these games will decide the title. Um, but I'll see you either around here or at the final. Thanks for watching and I'll see you again very, very, very soon. Okay, this episode was a little bit on the short side. And as always, when I do something wrong, I feel that I need to compensate my dear viewers. And the best way I find is with a joke. I guess you can call these things jokes. Well, uh, it's something that kind of resembles a joke. So here goes. What has four wheels and flies? A garbage truck. <laughs>